Hello guys and welcome back to this channel, where today guys I'll be showing you how to use Smartsheet Project Tracking and Rollup. So guys, the first thing that you of course need to do is go to Smartsheet.com and you'll be greeted by a website looking similar to this one. Now, when you did that, you just need to go and log into your profile. But guys, if you do not have one, you can always go and register to Smartsheet. But guys, if you do not know how to do that, you can always go to our YouTube channel where we have plenty of how to smart sheet videos where you can see how you can do this. Now guys, that we got that out of the way, let's see what we actually have in front of us here. So as you can see here, we have the smart sheet website where we can go and start from the home screen. So here we have some things that are suggested for us so we can go and create a new smart sheet here. Uh, here we have our notifications, which I at the moment don't have any, but be sure when you have some, they will appear here. Here you have your uh, folders, so you can browse here from your work apps, sheets, workspace, and deleted items. Here, guys, you have the recently opened, and here you have your favorites. And guys, here you have, as you can see, just a second, it's loading. So you have your name. So be just uh, one thing, guys, the, all the information that we uh, I am entering here is basically fake because for the sake of this video. So here you can search for work apps, share with you recently updated. And here, guys, you can go and see some new templates that you can add. And lastly, here you have all the information about your account in one place. Now, guys, let's see how to use Smartsheet project tracking and rollup. Well, a project rollup is uh, a project rollup summarizes the total of the planned work hours of the project, the total of the actual hours logged in, the aggregate of the competition uh, percentage based on all tests in the project and the tracker is a command line uh, application that updates an existing sheet with data from external sources and guys that will be everything for this video i hope that you found this video informative if you did guys don't forget to like this video share it subscribe to the channel put the notifications on and guys as always i'll be seeing you in the next video bye guys